Now, there are a number of things you've heard. But there is a habit you've left that you are fearing to speak about. I'm no longer afraid of speaking because I chose Sibwa. It's called theft. Stealing. You people think, oh, as you hear that I'm a skater. Those are the boys who have bags in town there. I would call things that, that are not mine that they are mine and take them, but they, were, they weren't mine. I saw that there is nothing taking me there. You steal and steal and steal, but you don't have value. My friends were dying. But I was not dying. I said, am I the devil? Am I so demonic? I'm surviving a number of accidents. I thought maybe it's the Lord's opportunity or chance to me. One day I was knocked down. Those big trucks knocked me. I fell down. For one month I was sick. I was a number of the things I was taking by then weren't even important. I told God, but why? I told God I'm done with stealing. After stealing, uh, sorry, after getting healed very well, I came and began schooling again. I came to learn of Judah High School. I found Pastor Yahweh. He helped me and entered me into the school. After entering, I forgot my life. I began now disturbing his very school. And I was among they that were disturbing the school with bad habits. They suspended me here a number of times. But he still forgave me. He told me, my son, come back and study. There is something he wanted to impart in me. But I never saw this. But God, now I'm beginning to, to understand that it is right. He forgave me. I, I, I came back to study. I'm done now with my senior six. And I'm going to senior, to, for, for university. I no longer steal. Even if I find somebody's property. I close my eyes and go away. I thank God because I'm transformed. And maybe blessed.